What's up? So uh, talking about talking about January's market summary. In the past, I've been doing month to month. Uh, I think at this moment in time, going back to year over is something that's relevant and is going to be just as helpful because I think uh, as you're going to find out in this information that. Um, things are starting to look a little bit brighter despite the lack of inventory. Absorption just went up a little bit at a 0.17 change, which is uh, uh, relatively a good thing. That means so homes are getting sold a little less quickly, although we're only talking about a few days here. Still, nonetheless, moving in the right direction for everybody. Uh, average list price, here you go, down 270K, that's valley wide. Uh, granted, it is still colder months and we're talking about January of 22 here. So uh, that being said, still uh, a decent sign. The median price stayed the same of 1.995. So that's okay news, it's, it's not the worst news. But these are just the list prices, okay? So now into average sale, this is where it gets even more exciting. Average sale price is down 560K value-wide on all purchases. So single family condo, residential land, uh, bodes well for um, for buyers. But at the same time, if you're a seller, you know, it's still, we're still up quite a bit and uh, there are a ton of comps out there that does still continue to support that you, now is a great time to put on an inventory because again, demand is still very high. Make no mistake, I'm not playing one side of the coin versus the other. So here's the other thing, average median price is up 60 grand. Still a lot of great signals for sellers and a lot of great sell signals for buyers. Uh, still a very competitive market. Really gotta have your, your uh, eggs in the basket ready to go to uh, win in this and um, I think you can.